Tiffany Rose's celebratory response to Kenya Moore's suspension from the Real Housewives of Atlanta. And in other news, Simon Gulbadia and Portia Williams go head to head clap back season for them both. Portia tries to call out Simon Gulbadia's fury for trying to catch Cruz with his calf less post and Simon also Claps back at Portia Williams for attempting to intercept his car flex post, you guys. I guess it always get busy on this celebrity street. So today we have some scotching hot tea that will leave your amused. So grab a comfy seat because this story is about to get in turns. But first, hey kings and queens, welcome back to the channel. It's Girl Royalty back with another celebrity relationship gist. To our returning subscribers, you guys are the re MVP. And if you're new, you're so welcome. Please consider being a part of us by hitting the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. Thank you. So in case you missed it, Simon had posted, my favorite color for a Rolls Royce interior is obviously Mandarin. I have owned three of them in the last seven years. I'm looking forward to a unification of all three of Mandarin interior color Rolls Royce in the very near future. Happy Monday, hashtag work hard, play harder, hashtag work for your dream life. And of course, posture clap back in a post on her story where she said unification of three meanwhile one hour hour down was sold along with the ferrari to buy the one spectre hashtag go away from me wife this hashtag happy insta flex hashtag find granny with pink poles <laughs> girl posture she's she's crazy y'all and of course simon replied saying here we go again with underground railroad concerning herself with why an experienced car enthusiast of 14 years make a strategic business decision to conduct multi-million dollar car trades stay in the mercedes benz i bought you in your name <laughs> guys i think simon hates y'all if y'all know where this underground railroad is coming from from the show y'all yeah, opening for the railroad at some point somebody's driving the train it's not electric like what we have now <laughs> it, it wasn't was the train maybe. really like you really thought like there was an actual train to come through? I'm saying the it wasn't, it wasn't a train at all. Just if they use it, that is just a new thing. I'm thinking it was like why it's no. It's almost hurtful to me to watch her be so. Um, that's a euphemism for people. Ding dong. Y'all better know Simon 8 on this one, but what are the folks saying? This individual says, one thing I know, two things for certain a divorce will show you exactly how much someone loves you. How you handle someone when you don't like them is the true display of your love mess another person says let this be a lesson to us all to stay away from that woman's husband before you inherit her problem this commenter says i didn't see it coming but simon you've become my favorite and another person says y'all don't remember when posture thought the underground railroad was a train and asked who was the conductor <laughs> Guys, that is so funny. It never gets old. And then this commenter says, Loving some publicity, 10 weddings, then becoming insta enemies is nasty work. Hashtag prayers. Well, we hope that Simon Gubadia and Portia Williams can grow up from all of this insta trolling, face their divorce head on, and of course, move on. Now, for Kenya Moore, in a thrilling turn of events, the reality TV world is abuzz with talks surrounding Tiffany Rose's celebratory response to Kenya more suspension from the real housewives of Atlanta. Tiffany, who was initially considered as a potential new housewife for the show, found herself entangled in a dramatic field with Kenya. The drama has reached a fever pitch. Many of you might recall how Kenya Moore was reportedly making waves about Tiffany joining the cast. The feud escalated when Kenya purportedly dug up personal information about Tiffany's house and stalked her for dirt. All the length some people would go for drama. Well, tables have turned, darlings. Kenya Moore has been suspended from our HOA amidst shocking claims of revenge porn. Yes, you heard that right. The news took the internet by storm. And guess who was the first to cheer? Tiffany Rose. You got that right. Kenya Moore was suspended from filming The Real Housewife of Atlanta after allegedly showing pornographic photos of new cast member Brittany Eddy. 
Britney Eddie at Moore's Hair Saloon opening party earlier this month. According to multiple media reports, Bravo was filming the party at the time for the 16th season of the long-running reality show. The series is not expected to air the new season until 2025. Currently, multiple media outlets, including TMZ, People and Entertainment Tonight, has confirmed this suspension. On June 8th, Kenya Moore took to her ex account where she tweeted, I would never engage in revenge porn. I have never distributed private images or footage of anyone nor solicited images owned by others to use to threaten or blackmail. I have always been vindicated. I can't talk about story even with people planting fake news. On June 14th, an Instagram Live she added, you will be seeing me. I'm not going anywhere despite all this stuff. According to agency, it's unclear what compared Kenya Moore to go after Edie, who joined the cast this season. Edie, who runs her own fashion and accessory line in an Instagram story set, it's never a good feeling being together or harassed by someone I thought would embrace me into a new circle that I never met. For the record, I've never once had possession of any weapons or threatened anyone ever. I've never been to jail in fight or even had as much as a speeding ticket. That's not my character. I'm hurt by the narrative that's being displayed wrong is wrong well apparently Kaya Moore has been suspended and Tiffany is rejoicing Tiffany who had been filming with the ladies of Arrow HOA for, for a potential spot posted a revealing message on her Instagram story she said I quote God don't like ugly now look she's fired that's a mic drop if ever I saw one <laughs> You guys, although Tiffany won't be holding a pitch in season 16 of Arrow HOA, don't fret, she's already on to bigger things with a new show in the works. So we'll be seeing more of this graceful yet fiery personality soon. What are your thoughts on Bravo suspending K.O. Moore from the show? And what is your thought on Tiffany's rejoicing over Kenya Moore sort of down for? You guys leave your thoughts in the comment section. You know I love to hear your thought and opinion. And that's all today on the T. As always, thank you so much guys for watching. If you got to this point of the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. And until the next one, remember to pray, work out, work smart, and slay. Bye-bye. <laughs>